It's like a crystal ball. I want them to be able to give the detective an understanding of who it is they're looking for. My name is Sandy Enslow, and I am the lead forensic artist for the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. I do not solve crime. That's the detective's job. My job is to deliver an image that they may need to assist them in their case. 75% of the time, the purpose of the sketch is to corroborate or eliminate information for the detective. The cognitive interview is part of this process. We want to get the best memory from this witness. And then we move forward and we start the drawing process. We complete a drawing within two hours. So once we're finished, I turn it around and I have them look at it. And I'm looking for them to make changes. What can I change to make this look more like what you remember? I have to be very aware of the time frame that my witness is able to sit with me. Are they getting worn out? Are they getting too upset? I also have to be very aware of legal ramifications. What is legally allowed for me to say or do? I'm going to have to answer in court. So knowing and understanding those legal ramifications, that's all part of the training of a forensic artist. There's immense gratification in seeing the case come together, knowing that I had a small part in it. As an artist, I make a difference in society. I'm able to use my art to a benefit. And it's one of the reasons I've stayed here. I don't solve crime, but it's addictive to help people, help witnesses and victims, help the detective in his process, in her process of moving that ball down the field to uh, solving a case. Hey Dateline fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on the button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch digital exclusives and original content from the creators of Dateline.